Hey everyone, Zephyr here, and moving on with Killer Instinct. And I don't remember what he wanted me to do. Oh, well, I think we're going after the leader, that's right. Hey there, kid. Remember to bring your weapon. I'm ready to fight. And don't call me kid. Ha! <laughs> Got some spark in you, eh, recruit? Good to see. We'll need it if we're gonna stamp out these renegades. Get ready to move, and keep your voice low. If we're lucky, we can catch these bootjacks sleeping. You really think we'll be lucky? Kid, we both know that kind of luck doesn't exist. Still, try to take prisoners if you can. We'll need them to give us information if Anvil Burn isn't there. So we just run in there and yell, Hello, bad guys, surrender or die. Look here, whelp. There's a time for strategy and there's a time for kicking the door down. We don't need tactics against this rabble. We just need force. Yes, sir, Warmaster. Right then. Don't worry about hello. Just skip straight to surrender or die. Now move out. I notice we get a lot of these brute force missions. Rush in. Beat the hell out of them. Mission accomplished. All right, we're good. They are actually sleeping. I sense an ambush coming on. By the spirits, is this some kind of kitty playground? Wake up out there! Time to do some music. That's amusing. I've been getting a little bit of lag going on this morning, so sorry if it well lags. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, there's gotta be something wrong with this. But I'll I can I can deal with it. I can totally handle it for now. Oh, I didn't even see those three. I gotta stop. I my jump attack got delayed behind, so I'm not comboing properly. Unfortunately, it's also the only thing that combos. There we go. Area retaliation. That's all you've got? Come on, you mangy runts! Oh, he's bringing down the tents to force them out. So, what was that about taking prisoners? Because it doesn't really seem like we're trying very hard for that. But we'll probably end up end up with a prisoner when this is over, or and will burn himself. Time to do some real damage. One more tent. The worst train, most cowardly loustabouts I've ever seen. Loustabouts? <laughs> oh, hey. Well, it's not animal burn. Oh, Iron Maid, huh? And he's dropping mines. Get out of the mines, idiot. Pain in my ass. And he just stands there in the middle of them. <laughs> Jeez. Pain for pain. I yield. Well. Yep, there's our hostage survivor. <laughs> he had to run back to where he spawned so he could fall over. I'm listening. <laughs> you shuck brained cur! Where's Ajax Anvilburn? We know he's behind the attacks on Ebonhawk. Spill! You, you just missed him. He, he left this morning. He's on his way to kill some worthless human named Duran. They're setting an ambush at Summit Peak. They'll kill Duran, then leave the bloody knife with old Steel Crusher. We're killing two peace lovers with one trap. Ashes and snow? He means Minister Kent Duran, the Crichton Ambassador. I bet Steel Crusher's the ambassador for the High Legions. You're vigil, aren't you? Ha! Ajax will be sorry he missed killing you. Tell his human-loving mother, Almora, that one day we'll spit on her grave. Almora's Ajax's mother? That's above your pay grade, recruit. Forget you heard anything about it. Forget? I can't just forget. Don't you think that's important? Whatever happened to discipline? Kids these days. All right, fine. But not here and not now. 
We'll talk about it later. Right now we have to evac before more renegades show up. Leave this coward to rot and die alone. Let's get back to Ebonhawk and warn Samuelson about Ajax's plan. I can do that. Do you have something to report? Yeah, unfortunately, parents in Char don't necessarily seem to mean very much. All right, and that's the end of that one. Still got some time to go, so I will catch you in the next one here in a second. See you there. Sometimes I really wonder why they don't just connect one to the next, because this wasn't even like a 10 second walk, hardly. I turned around. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Moving on. Who are you people? Commander Samuelson didn't mention an escort. And you certainly don't look like Vanguard. We're with the Vigil. We know about the attack planned for Minister Duran. We're here to make sure you reach him in time. An escort? I'm a soldier of the Ebon Vanguard. I don't need babysitters. We're not babysitters. We're tourists. Traveling the same road, taking in the same scenery, and beating the ever-living crap out of the same idiots as you. You look like a fine sergeant. Are you really gonna tell us where we can't go and who we can't beat up on such a nice day? I have to get this message to the minister. I don't have time for this. Just keep up or I leave you behind. Head out for Summit Peak, and don't slow down. Never tell a Norn who he can fine. and can't beat up. Just don't tell the rest of the Vanguard. I'll never hear the end of it. If I'd had a daughter, she'd be a lot like Jane. Except smarter, stubborn. Careful. <laughs> Except smarter, stubborner, and better looking. Where? Oh, there they are. Time to do some real damage. They telegraph their attacks so badly, and they're not even that strong. Stop dodging around me, you stupid little bastard. Ooh, too far. I, feel good. I wish I had knocked them back. Whoops. Unnecessary use of immobil immobilization. Stay alert. Keep moving. Well, then move faster, chick. Just one? Oh, there's the other guy. Other couple. Boy, they just spawned from all corners, huh? Oh, shameful mercenaries. Renegades, whatever. They should not affect it. It just gives you a weird impression of their group. I mean, an actual rebel army would consist of different different types of troops but these guys are all like they look like bandits and that's not very impressive or intimidating Ooh, veteran ogre brood i wonder if i have to go through him I see two of them wow stand the line we have to help her no we can't risk it if the ambassador is killed many more lives will be replenished to help you thanks abandon your own soldiers we all knew the risk when we joined the vanguard Duty first. I feel good. I wonder which way I'm supposed to go. What do you mean? Ebon Vanguard Archer. I wonder if I should go after her. Yeah, screw it. Let's do it. Hello, Mr. Ogre Roots. Oof. Knock me over, you little bastards. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Damn it. <laughs> That's right, bump into the wall. Stay put. Son of a bitch. Yeah, this was probably a waste of my time, but... You don't usually get side options. Worst case scenario, it does absolutely nothing. 
or maybe they're just kind of here to help. Get that at retaliation spreading, though. I really wish that immobilization chain counted as like a physical pre or a ranged projectile finisher. No such luck, though. Just keep that oof, retaliation up, and hopefully they'll beat themselves silly. One down. Did they kill the other chick? The renegades are stirring up anything they can find just to send them at us. Yeah, pretty much. What happened to the other girl? Thank you. I have no idea. But oh well. I'll help you make it to the peak. Why did Chen just stop moving back there? That's not helpful to me. Oh well. Oh, I would have had to go through the ogres anyway, it looks like. She would have walked right past them. I don't know why she hasn't cut through. <laughs> Gotta take the straight story route. Stick to the path. Honestly, sticking to the path is retarded. It is never intelligent. Well, okay, not never. But, a lot of times, the path is just asking to get ambushed. It depends on if you're more worried about beasts or people. And she keeps no, stopping. It's a trap. These guys are persistent. I'll give them that much. <laughs> I wish I had more combo stuff. Ah, sorry, it lagged out. I'm always afraid it's gonna just stop entirely and kick me. Oh, yeah, one of them didn't trigger. Nice. Time to do some real damage. One more. And into the wall. <laughs> Why did they stop fighting? Oh, these guys are so crazy. The AI is usually pretty good, but sometimes. I've seen much worse, though. I don't remember if it was Guild Wars 1. Might have been. I just remember the AI, the people, would get stuck on the tiniest little crevice. Run back and forth and back and forth and back and forth until you dragged them off a different direction. Oh, I lost track of them numerous times like that. Officer on site. Stand at attention. Okay, you tell us not to get left behind. Move your butt then. Move those legs. I keep losing the people I'm reviving. I only have the archer with me still. This is where I was going? This is not the peak. Oh, there's Steel Crusher. Oh, and Duran. They're, They're both here. This is the peak? Alright. Minister Duran, sir, please. It's critical that you hear this. Commander Samuelson sent me from Ebenhawk. You're both in terrible danger. Danger? Slow down, Sergeant. Take a deep breath and tell me what's going on. Ajax Anvilburn and his renegades are going to ambush you. They plan to assassinate Minister Duran and blame the attack on Ambassador Steelcrusher. Well, we can't let that happen, can we? Well, he's old Durant, for a char. Can you fight? Not as well as a char, but I can hold my own. We could take cover at Summit Peak up ahead. Having the high ground would be in our favor. The camp is a defensible location. If the renegades don't know we're prepared, we could turn the tables on them when they attack. With all due respect, Minister, the best defense is usually a good offense. I recommend we find the traitor's base and destroy Ajax before he can strike. The Vigil were the ones to uncover this plot. With due respect, sirs. I think we should let them decide if we choose ambush or assault. Alright, I get to choose which way to go again. Ambush or assault. Um, I'm more of a direct action kind of guy. 
Let's just go smash their camp into bits. And good, I was worried this one would continue straight into it. Which I didn't really have time for. <laughs> Strawberry pie, why not? That's that. Alright, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed the show. We will pick up next time with hopefully beating, beating the crap out of Ajax. And that'll be next weekend. Take care all, I'll see you then. Later.